Hello everybody and welcome to today's phonics lesson. Now if you have a hat, why not put it on? Nice to wear a hat sometimes, isn't it? Once you've got your hat on, I'm going to teach you a new song. Who was in the town? 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 Very simple. Who was, remember that tricky word was, was in, in, tricky word, the, and then t, ow, n, town, who was in the town. Yeah, I really like that sound in the middle of the word town. Ow, ow, that's the letters O and W, isn't it? The letters O and W make the sound OW, like we've hurt our finger with a needle or something. OW, when you might be sewing. Let's say that together. The letters O and W make the sound OW. Now it's your turn. The letters make the sound OW, like in T, OW. Mm. So who was in the town? Let me give you a little clue. Everybody who's going to town today, t ow n. They've got the letters O and W in their name. Ow. So with your uh, pen or pencil on your paper, could you just write down the letters O and W? Letters O and W. I'm going to put mine in a cloud. There we go, the letters O and W. Once you've done that, we'll be able to find out who was going to town, and then we'll write down who they are, and a little bit about what they look like. Okay, so, are you ready? Let's sing our song. Do you know what, actually, before we sing our song, I think I want to change my hat. It's nice to change hats, isn't it? Three, two, one. Oh, yes, lovely hat. Ready? Okay. Who was in the town? 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 Brown cow was in the town. Brown cow. Cow was in the town. Brown cow was in the town. Brown cow was in the town. Brown cow was in the town. Good old brown cow. <laughs> Lovely. So that's actually two words, isn't it, that have ow in them. We've got brown and cow. Brown cow. <laughs> oh. Now let's start off. We'll write the word cow, I think, first. Cow. So, let's stretch it out first. Cow. Cow. Now sound it out. K. Ow. K. Ow. K. Ow. Oh, very good. Can you write it before me? Ready, steady, off you go. So, K. That's going to be the letter C for the word cow. How do I write ow? If only I could remember. Oh, there we go. Letters O and W make the sound ow. K ow. Cow. Pause the video if you need more time. And then when you're ready, let's write the word brown. Now this is a hard one. I'm going to help you. You can do it by yourself if you want. But don't worry. I'll be with you, okay? Ready? Brown, brown. Sound it out. B, r, ow, n. B, r, ow, n. Have a go at writing it before me. Don't worry if you can't. You can do it with me. Ready? So b. So b. And r. Ow. O and W. O 
and W, ow, and then N, that's an N, a brown cow. Oh, pause the video if you need more time. Once you have got it right, give yourself a tick. And if you were really quick and got it right before me, give yourself two ticks. I think I need another hat now. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh yes, oh yes. Okay, ready for to sing our song again, okay? started to frown. He started to frown, that owl. Owl, yes. When you frown, you're a bit cross. Hmm. He looks a bit cross, that owl, doesn't he? Owl and frown. They've both got owl in them. Let's start off with owl, okay? Right, stretch it out. Owl. Owl. Sound it out. Owl. 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 Ooh, can you write it before me? Ready, steady, go. Ow. And then, ooh. Ow. Oh, absolutely super. Now, frown, okay, frown. <clears throat> if you're feeling a bit like you need to skip on, okay, if your child, mum or dad maybe is... is you feel like they're losing a bit of concentration, you don't have to do the word frown. But it's a challenge. If you want to do the word frown, you can. So let's stretch out the word frown. 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 Sound it out. Fr. Ow. N. So that's fr. Ow. N. I'm going to write it over here. So. Can you do it before me? Can you do it with me? Err. Ow. Err. Ow. N. There we go. Pause the video if you need more time. If you need to copy mine, that's fine. Give yourself a tick once you've got it right, and two ticks if you did it before me. Now, before we look at our phonics book today, I think we should put these words into a sentence. So you could say, very simply, the brown cow was in the town. The owl was in the town, but he started to frown. Or you could come up with something completely different. It's up to you. Have a think. Then tell your mum or dad, your brother or sister. Tell your cat, tell your dog. Okay? Once you've done that, I think I need another hat. Three, two, one. Yes. My nice sun hat here. Um, once you've done that, it's time to pick up your sound phonics book. Phase three, book two. And you need to turn to page number 28. Goodness me, we've done so much of this book. 28. A two and an eight. Ow. Like in the word k ow. Say it loud. Ow. Say it quietly. Ow. Say it like a mouse. Ow. Ow. <laughs> ow. Circle any words that have the ow, well, pictures that have the ow sound in them. So k ow. A cow. K ow. That's got ow, isn't it? You can always stretch it out and sound it out if you, if you can't be sure. Okay? So once you've done that, we've got some words over here. And they're all in crowns. Crown. Well, that's got the owl sound, hasn't it? Krr, ow. Mm. It's got owl. If it's got owl in it, you colour it in. If it doesn't, then you don't colour it in. Yeah. And that is that, really. Okay? So take your time to read them. Mums and dads, they don't have to read them all. But 
you know, you can come back to it if you need to a little bit later. Once you've done that, there's only one last thing to do. I think I'm going to change my hat again to say goodbye. Ready? Three, two, one. Yes, there we go. Last hat for today. Bye-bye, everybody. Have a super day. I'll see you tomorrow for more phonics.